Sebrakate Yahawa, Rakate O Shai, Rakate Yahawa, Rakate O Shai, Rakate Yahawa, Rakate O Shai. First and foremost, I want to give our praises and honor and glory to Yahawa by Hashem Yahweh Shai, by Hashem Raka Kodash, double honest to the apostles and elders who rule well at Great Millstone, and I bless the sanitation to the Akims and the folk on the earth, pushing the gospel in sincerity and truth shall one. This evening, I come next lesson to feed the elect and the nation of Israel, the 144,000 and the one third men, women, and children. And the confusion of faces is getting the folk on the earth. And I just want to touch on um, this, this precept in um, Joel chapter 2, verse 13. Because when, people, when most people paraphrase it, they say, Render your heart, but the word there is rent. Right? And the Hebrew word is, is uh, kara, right? Which means to tear, right? There's a Hebrew word for rent, which means to tear, right? It's um, Joel 2 and 13. He said, and render your, he said, and rent your heart, and not your garment. So the most I say, yo, you know, it was a, it was always a, it was a culture, a custom. So like your custom in Israel, if something drastic happened to a family member, as a, a close relative, you know, are the most I about to bring great plagues upon the upon the land oh what our food father will do they will rent they will rent rent the garment right they will rent the garment is a custom right let me, let me, ask, let me get an example in genesis right they will rent the garment so the most i tell me yo instead of start instead of instead of chain up your garment you know rent your heart which is your mind humble yourself right that's basically what the most i say Right, Genesis 30, 37 and 34. All right, let's get a quick example to show you that it was a, it's a custom in Israel. All right. Um, this is Genesis. Right. Genesis 34. Genesis 37 34. Alright. Um, and this is when um this is when um when Joseph brought them sell him to the Ishmaelites. And he came back and tell his father that um you know that you know some kind of some beast some beast devour devour him. Right? Um start from um Start from verse 27, right? Genesis Genesis chapter 37, verse 27. He said, Come, this is the brother I'm saying, right? He said, Come, come and let us sell him to the Ishmaelites, and let not our hands be upon him, for he is our brother and our flesh, and his brethren were con content. Then they, he said, Then they passed by the Midianites, merchants, and they drew and lift up Joseph out of the pit because of the put in a pit. Right? They was trying to kill him. You know, God was jealous of him, right? And and sold Joseph to the Ishmaelites for twenty pieces of silver. And they brought Joseph into Egypt. And Reuben returned unto the pit. And behold, Joseph was not in the pit. And he rent his clothes, so he rent his clothes. Cause he said to feel sorrowful. So we do he rent the clothes. He would rent the go back to the to the Hebrew word which is which is kara, which is which is the tear. Like right? see rent the garment. Right? So it was a custom. It was a custom in, in Israel. Right? He said verse 30, and he returned unto his brethren and said, The child is not, and I whither shall I go? And they and they and they took Joseph coat and kill a kid of a goat and dip the coat in, in blood and they and they sent the coat of many colors and they brought it to their father and said this have we found no he said no how whether it be thy son coat or not he said and he knew it and said it is my son son coat and evil beast had devoured him joseph is without doubt rent his rent in pieces and joseph and jacob and jacob rent his rent his clothes 
and put sackcloth upon his loins and mourned for his son many days so it was it was always a custom in in, in israel if any sorrow happened, if any sorrowful thing or any close one to anybody pass away they would rent the garment right so there was always a custom in israel so the most i was saying instead of tearing up your clothes before me humble yourself rent 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 your heart which means to humble yourself your heart go back to your mind right so he said back in Joel 2 and um, 13 he said he said rent he said rent your heart and not your garment so stop tearing up your garment the most i said stop tearing up your garment you know tear your heart humble yourself right he said, and turn unto the Lord Yahweh your power, for he is gracious unto for he is gracious and merciful, slow to anger, and of great kindness, and repented him of the evil. So the most I say you will repent, turn away from the evil, humble yourself, and the most I will forgive you. Once you humble yourself. So this is what the most I tell me today to do. We gotta humble, right? We got humility. Humility come before honor. Right, so we got a humble, and the most high, the most high, the most high look towards a humble person, right? So we got, we got a humble ourself, right? This is Isaiah, right? We got this Isaiah. The most high look towards a humble person, right? You know, we from the, we from the ground, which is at at um at at um Adama, right? We from the ground, so we low. So if we from the ground, we got a humble ourself, right? This is um, Isaiah 57 and 15. For thus said, for thus said the high and love and lofty one that inhabited eternity, whose name is holy, I dwell in the high and holy place with him also that is of a contrite and humble spirit to revive to revive the spirit of, of the humble and to revive the heart of the contrite one. So the most I say, yo. This is this this is this is this is the man that he looked to a man, a man with humble spirit. So you gotta be humble. This thing is all about humility. So you gotta be humble. So this is the man that the most I look to, right? And this same thing our food Father King David was saying, right? This is Psalms. Um, Psalms um, fifty-one verse sixteen. He said, "For thou desire not sacrifice, else would I give it." Thou delighted not in born offering. So the most I done with animal sacrifice. The most I don't delight in that. So this is this is what King David said, the most I delight in. He said, The sacrifice of Yahweh are a broken spirit. Me humble. When something broken, you know, it's sorrowful, you're humble. You'd be sorrowful for the wickedness that you did. Right? A broken and contrite heart. O Yahweh, thou will not despise. So this this is sacrifice of the most I to be humble. It's to humble yourself right it's the it's a it's a humble yourself this is isaiah 66 right is isaiah 66 and um isaiah 66 and 2 for all those things had my hands made and all those things have been said the lord but but to this man will i look even to him that is poor and of a contrite spirit and tremble at my word so the most I can look to a man that is humble, right? A man that is humble is really the most I can look to. The most I can show that man mercy, right? Got the man, the man of a humble spirit, right? This is um Ecclesiastic, Ecclesiastical chapter two verse seventeen. They that fear the Lord will prepare their heart and humble their soul in His sight. Yeah, they that fear the Lord, Yahweh Bashem Yahweh, they gonna gonna prepare their heart and humble their soul in His sight. So it's all it's all about humility humility before honor right so we gotta what we gotta do we gotta we gotta rent our heart which is your mind right we gotta humble yourself we gotta we gotta for we gotta turn away from evil we gotta repent and humble yourself you know fear your how about shame your shine with that was this was defiant i want to give our praises and honor and glory to yahweh by hashem yahweh shai by hashem rakakodash Double honors to the apostles and elders who move well at Great Millstone and a blessed sanitation to the in the folk and the earth to push in the gospel in sincerity and truth. Shalom.